So Chrome OS Flex is one of the most popular choices for the low end as well as the old PC or laptop. And in this video we will discuss why and also how to install Chrome OS Flex on your PC and laptop. So let's get started. The interface of Chrome OS Flex is very much like the Android uh, 12 or 13 and now we have the material you theming as well so we can set or choose the colors from the wallpaper or and we have a lot of uh, wallpaper sets so we can choose any of the wallpaper and the the colors will actually change according to the colors of the wallpaper and we can also choose from the preset four combinations we of course have the light mode and dark mode and also screen savers which has three styles which looks really good now coming to the applications it has all of the web apps most of them are web apps but if you have enabled the linux we can install a lot of the games and applications using the terminal and uh, if you are familiar with linux you can do that and also using the app store so it makes it really easy to install a lot of the games and applications like you can check out the list of the supported Linux applications across multiple genres and I actually installed Steam which is a very popular gaming uh, program and you can actually I have also installed a game called the Metro and I also shown uh, the gameplay in my previous Chromos Flex versus Windows video and uh, I was surprised how uh, uh, playable it was and uh, if you have a good spec PC you can also search for these Linux titles and then all of these uh, titles that are shown here will be playable you can buy them and then play it on your chrome os flex make sure to check the description for all these tutorials and now coming to the browser if you are using mainly this uh, chrome os flex for browsing we have now the full flex chrome browser which supports multiple profiles as well so i have a guest profile running and i can use these side by side so that is really good and as it is the full fledged Google Chrome browser, we also have support for the Google extensions and the Google password manager and everything that is new in the Windows, all the Linux version, we get it here as well. So we do not need to sad load it using the terminal. And if you also, if you're not into Google Chrome, you can also download the Firefox browser or anything else. If you want the Brave browser, you can also install that here and we have the full fledged version. So that is really good. So now for the installation part, on your Windows computer, we will first go to the Chrome web extension, the store for the web extensions and we will search for the Chrome recovery utility. So this is the tool that we are going to use to install the Chrome OS Flex. So once we have searched and then add it to your Chrome browser like I've done. Now click on the extension icon on the top right and select the Chromebook recovery utility. Now this window will pop up. So first of all, click on the gear icon. On the top right and then select erase recovery media now plug in your pen drive and then get started now this will erase your recovery media or your pen drive and this will prevent any errors from uh, getting in your way later on now we will uh, select the product list and we will select the chrome os flex from the list and also from the product we're going to select chrome os flex now choose your pen drive and then start the process Now this is going to take a long time according to your internet connection now it's going to write and do all that and it's going to take a long time so the next step will be after the second method so it's going to be the same for the both methods so we'll continue after that so for the second method we'll visit this website which will be in the description now you can see a lot of versions which are listed down so among it just click on the latest one it's going to download the file i will also download the rufus which we will use to create the bootable media so download the latest version now after downloading it open the rufus application and select your pen drive now we'll select our image that we have downloaded for the chrome OS flex it's going to be dot bin dot zip so just select that now everything else will be set by default so just hit the start uh, the start option and just confirm now it's going to take a long time for to copy and do everything so once it's done power off your computer then press the boot menu key and the power button and you will see this option so what we do need to uh, select your pen drive and you will see the chromos flex logo and then the setup screen so uh, just 
select your language and get started now we have two options either to install it or try it first you can try it first if you want to uh, take a little sneak peek but we're going to install the chrome os flex and the installation will delete everything the windows your drive your files everything so make sure you remember that and uh, once the installation process is finished you will see a timer and your system will shut down and after you power it on you need to connect it to your wi-fi and finally we will have to add our google account and you can see it says here uh, add a google account to your chromebook and not chrome OS flex and make sure if you do not want to send any anonymous data to unselect this option and also if you continue again you will see this another option that uh, um, tells you if you want to send your data to google so if you do not want to do that make sure you uncheck that you can also configure some additional settings related to trackpad or your size for your text and font so you can also do that and finally select your dark theme or light theme or the auto according to your day and we are all set and we can start using the chromos flex so this is how you install chromos flex on your laptop or computer if you have any questions make sure you leave them down in the comments check the description for tutorials and links and i'll see you in the next one thank you for watching